I recently learned something that left me wondering if the earth is transmuting into a diseased brain. Furthermore, I was so agitated that my eyeballs felt as though they were multiplying into bunches of grapes that could be fired from the orbitals of my skull like shrapnel. This story is of a woman who is a convicted serial killer. She and her first husband were a team and had committed a series of unspeakable crimes more than 30 years ago. The husband died in prison of rectal cancer, but the wife was released after only 16 years, despite the fact that she willingly participated in over 10 brutal rapes and murders, she was given a short prison sentence in exchange for testimony against her husband. Today, this dangerous sociopath goes by another name and lives in a home on one half acre of property in a suburb of California. She and her new husband ask for money and other donations for two organizations they run. She uses her diminutive stature and mousy demeanor to convince the public that she was a victim instead of a willing partner and co-conspirator in the crimes. After a record album skips three times and a cock crows twice, Another rodent will die, and I will dance on all the grapes until they turn to wine. <laughs>